Hello and welcome to Realistic Zomboy Project with me, Bon Bon B. I'm Bon Bon B. I'm Bon Bon B. You're very, very welcome. Right. So today I might go and use a gun because we have a gun. Boom, 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 boom. Maybe not use it now. Put the gun away before you injure somebody. Probably yourself. Right, so we're going to want some food. Have I got anything? Meat patty. Let's grab that. And we are going to turn on the oven. Put the meat patty in the oven. And we will ready ourselves for the day. So, um, yeah. Thing is, I'm close to fully burdened basically let me put the magnum rounds into the backpack scissors we can offload actually scissors place that on the table we've got hammer and screwdriver we need we need all of this don't really need the can opener do we let's offload the can opener on there that's cooking but yes we are really close to our carrying capacity though we do have the backpack we might be using the backpack a lot but yes I think today I would just like to go out and try the gun out it's a bit of a gamble because I don't really know what I'm doing but we're in a town where most of the zombies have been killed so a lot of the danger element has been taken away and it's not like we don't have a crowbar right we have eaten have I got anything for the journey let's grab bag of chips for the journey I like that idea right so do we equip the crowbar in both hands I think we do and generator probably now is a good time to deal with it let's grab the gas can grab one Turn off the generator, add fuel, turn on the generator, that's 100%, how much we've got less in the gas can, nothing, completely empty, that is perfect as they say. We do have the sledgehammer which I'm tempted to use to smash down a door which um, we were down that way a couple of days ago I'll show you on the map in a moment I think what will end up happening here is I will empty my clip, panic switch to the crowbar I know that's going to happen I know it Right, okay, the map. The map where we have cleared a lot of the town. This area here is a little bit nervy. Um, let's just head up to that kind of area. I mean, we have a car to run away when I get really scared because I'm going to get really scared I don't know what I'm doing here but yes we have a gun we have just a little bit of ammo this isn't a full, sl full scale slaughter of zombies using guns this is playing with a gun for the first time 
because that's going to be safe, surely. Surely nothing can go wrong. What could go wrong? Hmm? What could go wrong? Apart from everything. <laughs> End of the game, that's it. Bonboni, dead. Carefully drive around the ugly black monstrosity. Right now, we know that there's definitely bodies up this way. There's one. Right, so this is where the fun begins. I am going to switch to four and we are going to get right up close and personal because frankly oh hello woo <laughs> okay well that works Anybody else want to come? Because I got the boomstick and it went boom. And it wouldn't surprise me if a million zombies came to that water. Wow, that was a big boom. Curious. Skills. Um, aiming and reloading. Well. Oh, hello. Hi. Good to meet you. Oh, no. That was a bad miss. He's dead. I'll take the leather jacket. Little reward. Now the thing is, oh, how many more shots have I got? Maybe a few. Okay, oh, another one. Yeah, they're all coming. No, 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 no. Right, okay. Because I'm not really ready for equipping both hands. Fast reloading. We killed our first couple. Make sure there's nothing coming up the road behind us. There is. So, yes. I'm slightly less nervy of the guns. But reloading is going to be something I'm going to have to learn really quickly. If I'm going to be playing this game. Walkie talkie. Do you know what? Let's just drop that off. We'll take the magazine. Well, that was fun. We had a moment. You've got a walkie talkie. Some long socks as well. School bag. You poor kid. Hey, yeah. Oh, I need water, don't I? I think, at some point. Nothing there. Nothing there. 
end. Yeah, we've already seen that. Let's go to the restaurant, pick up some water. So I am a little bit lowish, I think. Pile of crap. Oh, and we have a friend. One shot kill. My favourite sword kill. So anyway. As long as there's nobody home, and there shouldn't be. We've already done the work in here. Yep. Fill all the bottles. Okay, back to the car. Oh, back to the car. Anything down that way? No. So, we could be clearing off some houses, really. I think we probably should. Let's do something. Got the wrong side, didn't I? Walked all the way around the car. So yes, empty the clip. How many kills do we get with the gun? That's the question. The answer is three. You got three kills with the gun. Well, there you go. And then we went right back to the crowbar. Because. Too scared to use a gun properly. Now. Let's be wary. Because these, car these cars. These houses. Have not been cleared. I'm suspecting. There's nothing in the grounds, because I imagine that the gunshots would have dragged in anything that was in this immediate area. Uh-huh. Locked. Don't make me smash the door, the window. Door works. Still haven't made a list of books. Dang it. Okay. Uh, while we're here, we will food it. Grab everything that looks like food that isn't stale and check that bookshelf. Oh, you've got a lot of things there. Mind you, probably got all of them. That'll be the thing. End of today. Battery, we'll take that. End of today. <gasps> Box of shotgun shells, thank you. And another shotgun. A leash. What use is that to us? One does not know. Right, so. One house done. Very wary. Check the grounds. Grounds look quiet. Door is now working. Can I open the kitchen knife? Where we make more spears and some more food. Lovely. 
how to use generators, just in case you ever need it. Not that we haven't got copies. Hiking bag. Oh, what's that carry? Capacity seven. No, sorry, twenty and seven. Whereas this one is twenty-seven. Oh well, we takes much more. I will take it with us, just because. And the padded jacket. Do you know what? We'll take that clothes-wise. Seems like a good idea. Okay. Oh, did we check? Right, it's checked. Let's mark off a couple of rooms. Rooms, doors, houses. There we go. And I'm going to offload what I'm carrying. Bring my weight level down. <coughs> oh, yeah, that was something, wasn't it? of stuff. Maxi. And the next house. Well, when it finally finishes moving things onto the back seat. Okay. Anything in the mailbox? Nope. use generators in here as well. Hang on. Are we still in the same house? Yes. I've managed to move the car to the house that we were just in. What a fool. Um, driver's seat. Let's get those crisps in me. Say crisps. Chips. Have I got no chips? Alright. Fair enough. Nothing in the mailbox. Have a quick look around the outside. Again, just to be sure. Not seeing anything there. Not seeing anything around the back. I think we can try the window. Oh! Oh! Okay, do you think there might be somebody in here? Very nervous about that. We'll see if there's a window around there. We've got a window around here? Doesn't look like it. Wow. Okay. This looks like a survivor house with no survivors in it. Um, didn't really want to do that. Let's take all of that, chuck it on the floor. Can we pick up? I mean to do that. Crate. We can. Can we put the crate in the car? Crate. Size of that 7.5. Should go in the back seat. I'm a little concerned about what might be in the bathroom. I mean, frankly, we should be alright. I 
Oh, we picked up a whole bunch of stuff. Let's. Right, okay. <laughs> oh man. Panic! <laughs> and a shovel. Wow. Your nails. Let's fill up the bottle. Whilst we're here. Wood glue. We'll take that. Another shovel. Duct tape. Rope. Wood glue. Nails. Canned produce. I'm going to stop at that point because we could get greedy and just take everything. Don't need everything. But this was uh, a neat little find. Very nice little find. Load some of this as much as we can, anyway. Is that everything? Looks like it. And we're going to do this house next. Might have made sense to drive around the corner. Have a little look down the side. Not seeing anybody. Okay. That window appears to be locked. There's a garden hoe there. Hard hat, tarp, you know what, we'll have the hoe. Right, we're in. Canned produce. Oh, come on. Have a little look in here. Hunter Magazine 1. Almost certain I've got that. Angler 1. Yep. <laughs> clear. Clear, clear, clear. Back down to the car. So, if we've got anything on us here, we can put in the back, including garden hoe and pickaxe. Pickaxe, pickaxe. Okay. Oh, I'm just going to mark these houses off. Those two houses being fooded. Good, good. Not seeing any activity, which is nice. Cleaver, canned potato, like something, 
And that's not too bad. Over here, so, well, maybe I think I've got it, but it seems to be something I should take. Right, and that house has been done. Mildred. Really good to meet you. Our box, nothing. I'll get around the bin, will you? We are hungry. Locked. No, 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 the climb, we'll take that as well. We'll take your leather jacket. Yeah, that was not clever. Got a few nice books there as well. Got any food? Don't mind if I take your food. Got any canned brains? Do have a can opener though. Do you know what? Just because we are hungry, I'm going to eat the canned potato. Right? Drop that. And. Where's the can opener? What? Well, I thought I had the can opener. Did have a can opener. Danged if I can find it now. Right. There's two more houses checked off. On the food run. Cleared. Cleared. Two more. This time, be careful. Don't climb through a window if there's a zombie right there. Makes a bit of sense. Let me just try the door. There we go. Again, might need some of these books. Somebody didn't make a list because somebody's an idiot. Two more can openers. One more house to do on this little foray. Oh. Oh. I hear something and I'm aware of somebody behind me. Do you know what? It's got me a bit spooked. Anything around the garden? Where is this zombie? Right, it's in the bathroom. Which is fine. Because it means... We can have a jump scare. Well, 
zombie has a key. Has some cigarettes for the cigarette school. And the camera. Nice, I'm just going to shut that door. Our paranoia. We will take that because why wouldn't we? And then in the cupboards, we have some canned provisions. Oh, there was some more goodies there. Somewhere. Margarine orange soda. What's in the paper bag? Some straws. Fantastic. Well, I'm going to drop the paper bag. Don't really want that. Um, I think we're good. I think we are good to go. Let's just check the wardrobe while we're here. Leather gloves, I will have. Duct tape, I will have. Oh my god. And the rifle. I think that will do. Let's re equip the crowbar. Let's mark this map off. Not map off, house off. And that one. So, eight more houses cleared. Am I equipped? I am. Back to the car. Journey home. Not a bad day. A few kills as well. Where are we up to? 413. Bonbon the E is fast approaching, being the second most proficient zombie killer in. Uh, this playthrough. I mean, Bob Bonnet, who had the entire horde, everything to deal with, is the winner. And Bob Bonnet, with his guns now, I think, could be up there with a chance of uh, catching him. Maybe. Possibly. It's a long way to go. Still got a thousand to kill and there's definitely not a thousand in Muldrow so we're gonna to have to go out and about to get anywhere near that number. Hiya, you appear to be lost. Let me give you directions. That's right and then while you're down there you take a little swing there and everything's good. Oops. I'm getting the car. <laughs> and then the seat's occupied. I put stuff on the seat. So, heading home. End of a end of a good day. Apart from climbing through a window, and I didn't want to. Can I have some lights, please? It's better. Still got a little bit of a journey to get home. But yes, the reload on the guns, something I need to practice. Maybe if we carry a second gun in the holster, I can just switch between guns. That might be a thing. I would say might be a thing, is a thing. Just something I haven't really worried about yet. And of course we've got the crowbar, which we are very proficient with. Because it doesn't jam. <laughs> right, so, back to base. to go in the morning. I wouldn't have thought 
it would be out the other way, would it? Yeah, we'll probably go back that way tomorrow. Maybe. Lights off. Off. Engine off. But what not? Let's collect some of our stuff from the back. Well, we are loaded, aren't we? Let's take all of it in our hands. Yep. And it's unload time. Past the gas cupboard. Oh, left the doors open. Well, that's a bit silly. Hopefully nobody came this way. I'd still have to get through a gate if they did. Right, cans, of which I have a few. Right, canned provisions. Oh, look, we'll try that again. Canned provisions. There we are. Do like a day like this, where you don't die. Can provisions. Uh huh. Back off downstairs. We've got some margarine somewhere. Can go in the fridge. Thank you. Oh, it's a freezer. Fridge. Better. We have a disposable camera for the table. Oh, we had some guns, didn't we? Hang on, let's offload these in the armory. A rifle. Well, that has to go in here. Then we had oh some weapons, some sorry ammo even. A two oh two two three go round. Cool. Then in here, cigarettes for the cigarette score. Takes us up to seven and sorry, seven nine two. Not bad. Oh. We haven't sorted this area out, but We'll throw the clothes in the wardrobes, like so. And then, we've got two hand axes. One's not in great shape. Maybe you can fix that. Let's throw the not in great shape one into uh, a box. We have a meat cleaver. Come on, meat cleaver. There we are. CD and magazine. Now what have we got here? Lanes. We've got all of those. Of course we have. CD. Place that on the table. Duct tape on the table. I didn't actually achieve that. Back to the car. It's getting dark. Right, so nothing in there. But definitely stuff in here. Start with the back seat. Start with the back seat. Job. And then we'll go with the other back seat. Can we get any more in there? A little bit. And we can juggle this lot. And then we've got a garden hoe. Hey ho. I'll 
drop over here. When I find it again. If I find it again. There it is. Drop that. And then. Let's. Some tools and stuff. For the house. Well and truly sorted. We've got all of the weapons and tools and stuff. Tomato paste. I do like tomato paste. We're using it in virtually everything we cook. And then shovels. Useful for burying bonbons. A wrench. Shotgun shells for upstairs. Anything else here? Duct tape. Place that on the table. Battery. Battery. Place that on the table. We've got a few. Oh, and there's a watch as well. Place that on the table. And I'll be very cross if it's got an alarm on it. Very cross. Right, we have some ammo. 44s. Which is what we didn't use today, I think. We have some more canned provisions. There it is. It's amazing just how much I've collected. <laughs> we could survive for years here. Well, a while anyway. More leather jackets. Drop that one. I will drop that one. And I keep the padded jacket. Because insulation, when it gets cold, I think that's got to be better than nothing. And a hiking bag as well. We will organise the wardrobes at some point. Just not yet. I've got a shotgun as well. Let's offload the shotgun. In the shotgun cabin. cabinet. How about that? Right, now, we've got a crowbar in the backpack, which is something we don't really want. We've got one in our hands, which is in good condition. Uh, orange soda. Do you know what? I can drink it. Which leaves us with some shotgun shells for upstairs. And a magazine for the shelf. This magazine for out here. Put in the garbage. <coughs> Don't tell me they're all full. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. And we have... We're very tired. Poor fellow. And the magazine for the shelf. Shotgun shells for upstairs. And we'll go to bed. Get some kip. <coughs> and I'll suck a sweet or something. Deary me. Uh, shotgun shells go in this one, don't they? Great. It's going to be by night's time. Thanks for watching, for commenting, for liking, and for subscribing. Join me later for day three of three. Thanks for watching.